So the big question is this, how do small businesses like yours, who feel like you're doing all the right things and going to all the right events, reach the federal buyer in a way that helps you win more contracts? That is the question, and this is the place to get your answers. My name is Neil McDonald. Welcome to the GovCon Chamber of Commerce. Occasionally, you'll have need to find your congressional representative's name. You can come here to the United States House of Representatives website. The URL is www.house.gov slash representatives slash find your representative. And on here, you'll see find your representative is the top section. I'm going to go ahead and click in there. I already have my, URL, my um, zip code listed, so it's 20190. I'm going to press this button, find your rep by zip. And when I do, you'll notice that for my particular address, I have two possible choices. I have Barbara Comstock and Jerry Conley. So in order to figure out which one of them, I'm going to choose my state, Virginia, and do some magic back here, put my address in. It's right there. That's my business address, and that's all public, so I don't mind sharing it on the video. But there's my address. So I'm going to say find my rep by address. And the house tells me that Jerry Conley is my representative. So you want to contact these folks, and sometimes it's uh, – it's pretty interesting. There's two ways to do it, right? You can come into um, his website. I, I just right-clicked on that and opened a new tab. This is a little convoluted to try to figure out what to do to be able to contact these people. I really just want to shoot him an email, and you can't do that. There's no jerry at house.gov anymore. Um, but if you come back to this site that you landed on, down below his picture I have an email icon so I can pretend like I'm going to send him an email, but really it's a web form. So the first thing it wants to know is that, um, that I'm not a robot, right? So I'm going to put in my zip code. It's asking for the four, and this is something I want you to know. If you don't know what your last four for your zip code is, on that first page when they found Jerry, I'm going to click back to it, right here you'll see information provided, and they found my extra four numbers for my zip, zip code. So I'm going to go back and put 3388 right here. If I did not do it, it would give me an error. Then I'm going to say I'm not a robot, and I'll hit submit. Okay, so when I did hit submit, you'll notice that I now have a form, and this is pretty cool because it's all the basic information, right? You're putting your own stuff in. You want them to respond with an email here for updates. Um, no, I'm sorry. That's actually This is actually spam me uh, with your political stuff. I don't particularly need that. Um, you can talk about what your email relates to, and for me, I'm providing this video often to people about the HUBZone program and telling them to contact their congressional representative or for 8A firms, women-owned firms, or other small businesses to reach out to your congressional representative. Let them know you exist. Uh, you'd be amazed how few of people respond. So uh, what they look for is just a subject line and a comment, and that comment is basically the body of an email. So again, that was a quick little video that just showed you how do you find your congressional representative. You just come to the House uh, of Representatives website and you'll be able to find that for yourself.